Hello guys, this is Reese from Bomberito St. Peter's Volkswagen in St. Louis. Today I'm bringing us a treat. I got my hands on a 2022 Nissan Pathfinder Platinum in deep ocean blue pearl. This is a V6. This is top of the line for Nissan. This thing tows 6,000 pounds. Very nice. We had to travel a little bit to get this one. A friend of mine from Nissan allowed me to shoot a video of this guy. We're gonna take a quick look inside this thing. This is a thing of beauty. It features keyless entry on four doors, power windows right there. And as we look inside this car before I step in here, man, this thing is comfortable. Captain's chairs center console that's removable and six full-size adults can fit in this guy also you have a giant panoramic sunroof as we climb in here this has pro pilot assist which is your uh, lane assist also it has um, 360 camera adaptive cruise control lane assist blind spot monitoring all of the usual suspects and also, I'm going to lower this temperature here. We'll get to this stuff in a second here. But this is a great car. Look at the visibility here. And did you see that? Heads up display right there. So you got heads up display. You got this brushed aluminum finish right here. Nice, soft, like leatherette type feature here with the stitching right into the door handle. Two seat memory here. Also, uh, heated and ventilated seats. It's a leather wrapped steering wheel very nice setup there digital cockpit right here paddle shifters man this thing is, is decked out nice this does not have a CVT so for those of you who thought CVT was the only thing that Nissan built you're wrong this is a new nine-speed transmission uh, as I said this will pull uh, 6,000 pounds it has trailer braking capability anti-sway capability so if you're towing very nice setup there dual zone climate zone here Heated and ventilated seats, as I said. The ventilated seats are on. They feel great, great in this car. Here's a look at your uh, infotainment system here. It has Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, both wireless. Using Bose audio system right there. Nice flat dash across here. Great visibility. You do also have this rear view mirror here with your built-in garage door opener down here at the base. A vanity mirror on each side. There you go very nice setup here very nice uh, then you do have a um, little storage bin right here and I'm doing this on the fly guys this is the first time I've got my hands on one of these there's your Nissan assist uh, your SOS button right there let's see here we're gonna play with some stuff here there is the sunshade going back for your sunroof and then it's a power sliding sunroof pop-up windscreen there this pane of glass tucks underneath the other right there so you have that and then that sunshade goes all the way back it's a double pane of glass there and then you can override that sunroof and it goes back even further leather seats it's kind of a reddish brown almost a dark burgundy color here on the seats very comfortable seat as i'm sitting here super cushy the bolster's nice adjustable seat belt of course there over here in the glove box there's our manuals and what have you there looks like your trailer extras also in there but this thing is set up nice this infotainment reminds me of Mazda kind of Audi it's fixed right here you got your phone and all of your different settings here Bluetooth of course is enabled here um, climate control you have the two dials here the sync button all of your uh, dial set up, or I'm sorry your fan setups and uh, your button setup is all right here push to start right here and stop on a steering wheel here volume control looks like song skip uh, and uh, um, fast forward or skip to the next song kind of thing here and again I don't know much about these so that's kind of why I'm kind of going through this like this but man the fact that I got my hands on one of these I couldn't pass it up center console right here very reminiscent of Mazda to fit and finish on the inside here nice deep storage well right here spot for loose change right here um, lots of storage down in here 
cup holders here, wireless charging right here. You do have USB hookups right there. They're kind of hard to see, but they're there. And then you have a 12 volt charger port right there as well. This shifter is interesting. It's got park reverse drive and manual mode right here and also neutral. To do reverse, you're gonna push this button in right here and then push up to go to neutral and then reverse. Kind of interesting that they have that kind of shifter like that, but uh, I've never seen one like that, but it's pretty nice. Let's take a look at the second row. As we go to the second row here, here's a look at the armrest. Folds down right here. Here's that removable center console right there as well. Uh, as we look at the seats here, very nice setup here. The second row seats are also heated. You have the buttons right here. Starts off on medium or high and medium then low and then off, just like the other brands. Climate controls right there. And there's two more USBs here. And then there is a plug-in right here. That is a three-prong plug-in so you can charge right there as well. As I climb in here, there's a front license plate there. I'm gonna climb in here. So this seat does have a little button on the side. It has a bar underneath I can slide the seat back. Lots of leg room here, it's probably hard to see, but there's the magazine pocket right there. One on this side as well. Here's a look through from the back to the front. There's the center console or instrument cluster. Center console right there, armrest, all of that right there. This car is super, super comfortable. You're not gonna complain about driving in this car on a long trip. Here's a look at the sunshade. It just pitches up right there and hooks in up here. You have that for the two rear seats and then the windows. You have a window lock on those as well, but you have two cup holders right here and a handle right here with a bottom to it. It's not all the way through and then room for more bottles and storage down here. The stitching on these seats is pretty, pretty awesome. Car seat hookups right here and here and also right here. Here's a look at that storage bin, more cup holders right here and then more of a storage bin here. And there is your third row seat right there. So what I'm gonna do now is hop out here and show you these seats. You have two handles right here to fold the seat down. You're going to use this manual handle here and to pitch the seat forward. You push this button right here and it's a power assisted seat. How about that? It leans forward on its own. It pitches forward completely. And there's a look at your third row seats. The headrests fold down. You just push those up just like that. And these seats are actually comfortable back here. Now I'm six foot one. I want to climb in here and I'll pull this seat back. Now this seat is just where it was. I'm six foot one. Now I'm sitting. It's kind of hard to see, but my foot is right here off to the right and my other foot right here straddling this rail a little bit. So it does displace me a little bit here, but I do still have room in this. It's not as much room as my car, but it's close. I own an Atlas. The third row seat in my car is pretty awesome pretty awesome but man you're still going to get a full-size adult back here and they're not going to complain much my knees are up um, off the floor I do also have a USB port right there it's kind of hard to see right there and I do have vents above my head here and above a head in the second row there and there also over here and a seat belt a uh, uh, hook up right there from the ceiling now I'm going to climb out here I just push this button right here power assist it goes forward we're going to go over the window sticker on this one. And just push that seat back. This one here, the way it's built is 50,420. Okay, so here, here's a look at the window sticker here. Uh, the engine, 259 foot-pounds of torque, 284 horsepower with a nine-speed transmission. Alloy wheels, spare tire. This one has uh, crossbars on the top as well. Exterior. You got the LED headlights, LED tail lamps, turn signals, and what have you there. So you might want to slow this down in the video. I'm just going to kind of scan over the window sticker here. Um, but total, you're looking at 50,420. Uh, this one has crossbars included. Uh, the captain's chair cargo package right here. 190 for splash guards, 390 for crossbars. Carpeted mats are 255, and the cargo package is 345, bringing it to a total of 50,420. MPGs, 25 MPGs on the highway, 20 in the city. Very nice alloy wheels here. It says Pathfinder right here on the side skirts in chrome along the side. And then we get along to the back. 
Pathfinder, large letters on the back here. Platinum four wheel drive. And as we open this guy up right here, this does have an easy kick open hatch too. Oversized reflectors on either side. Here's a look through from the back to the front. There's a look at that sunroof. And to fold the seats down, I just pulled this strap right here to put the headrest down. Same here and here. And then lift up here and push that seat down. Lift up here and push that seat down so you have this extra area here. Now this is extra here. My friend that bought this car actually has uh, this already installed for us here. Seat belt clips off to the side to uh, keep them away from getting snagged with cargo. So you have that on both sides right there. You also have another 12 volt charger port right here. Very nice setup. Here's a look through from the back to the front. And then your buttons up here to close. This car comes with a three year, 36,000 mile bumper to bumper warranty on it from Nissan. And if you buy from Bomberito, you're gonna get three years of free maintenance. Your 10, 20, and 30,000 mile uh, oil changes will be covered by Bomberito. Also, if you buy from Bomberito, or buy from me, or Bomberito, you're gonna get a 10 year, 200,000 mile nationwide engine and powertrain warranty free of charge. So if you're interested in a car like this, I can set you up. I'm at a Volkswagen store, but I have contacts at the Nissan store, take great care of you worth the trip in fly in drive out give me a call 636-290-4257 636-290-4257 i'm on instagram youtube facebook and twitter at reese sells cars thanks a lot guys stay safe stay healthy have a great evening